everyone. Welcome back to my channel. It's Jay Fong here. And today I want to share with you guys five must have winter outerwear. So I know what you guys are probably thinking, Jessica, it's February and you live in Southern California, <laughs> which are actually both true. I know that in Southern California, we're really spoiled. We don't really have a true winter like the rest of the world, but I love just buying winter outerwear. I just think that they're so much more fun and um, so much more stylish. And the good thing is I am not super, super cold, so I don't actually have to layer too much. So today I've identified five must-haves in my closet. These are outerwears that I keep going back to that I've purchased multiple different variations and just think that they work really, really well um, and they're super easy to pair. So let's just get right into it. So the first item I have for you is the leather jacket. I absolutely love the leather jacket. This one is from All Saints and I purchased this a few years ago and I knew that this was gonna be an investment piece. It was actually one of my first investment pieces in terms of outerwear and I absolutely love this. I remember the first year I bought this, I pretty much wore it every day that winter, which I know it probably was like two months, but I wore it every day. And honestly, this jacket just looks so good on with everything. And what I love about this specific leather jacket is that it just pairs so well with everything. It is something that goes well with just t-shirt and jeans, with button ups, with even a dress. And I think it's because it is slightly more fitted and um, I just think that it looks, again, just really, really sleek. The leather is so buttery soft. And um, as you continue to wear leather, you will see like certain wear and tear that is specific to you. So it's almost like after a couple years of wearing it, you get your very own special tailor-made leather jacket. So I think that every girl should have at least one leather jacket piece in their wardrobe. So the next item I have for you guys is a jean jacket. And I feel like the jean jacket is the unspoken uniform for anyone who works in an LA office. At any given time, I see someone with a blue jean jacket, a white t-shirt, and a pair of black jeans on around my office. Sometimes I even see multiple of them and it's, <laughs> it's sort of that unspoken outfit that everybody has in LA. And this jacket is from Levi's. I actually think this is a men's jacket. Um, I bought this a few years ago at Levi's and I really wanted something that was a little bit more oversized um, so I can just throw on top of everything. And it would make a really great throw on outerwear piece that I can throw on over t-shirts, I can throw on over sweaters, and this has definitely delivered. So I believe this is called the trucker jacket, which is slightly oversized, which is great because it's just so easy to throw on top of everything. So I highly, highly recommend it. So the next category of must have outerwear is a trench coat. Now I wish I still had my classic Burberry trench coat to share with you guys. Unfortunately, I did let that go a couple weeks ago. I decided to let it go because it was just a little bit too snug when I had originally got the jacket. I didn't really account for any of the layering that I will be doing in the future. So it was just a little bit snug. So whatever money that I made from that sale will definitely be going into a future purchase of another Burberry coat. But I do have here another trench coat. This is a slightly oversized and a cropped trench coat. And I just purchased this this past season. I am so excited to check this out. I unfortunately haven't had a chance to yet. But I just feel like a trench coat is so chic. It's so classic. There are so many different variations of trench coats. And I myself have probably a few different styles of trench coat or just outerwear that uses that same trench silhouette. It is just a great piece that you can wear, whether it's casual or formal. And I just love the versatility of a trench coat. It just always looks so chic on top of any outfit. And so I highly, highly recommend it. Personally, I love the beiges and tans of trench coat, but I understand it comes in blacks and navy blues and grays. And honestly, it can come in any color and the silhouette just honestly looks good on everybody. 
And as much as I love the well-fitted, well-tailored black blazer, I think everybody should have a really well-tailored blazer in their closet just for that occasion. The next item I think is a must-have is a just a little fun oversized blazer. This one's from Everlane. I purchased this um, actually at the start of last year and I was really excited to wear this and unfortunately I haven't had any occasion where I needed to bust out a blazer yet. And this is the Everlane, um, I believe this is the oversized coat and you can tell it's new because the tag is still on here. And I feel like anytime I saw anybody wear a checkered blazer on social media, it was Everling's blazer and I just thought it looked so good on everyone. I feel like oversized blazers are just a staple and it should be a staple because I feel like it fits any body type and it is just one of those things that just helps elevate any outfit you have on. If you have a more casual outfit on, you can just throw this over just to make it a little bit more buttoned up. And if you have something like a white button up underneath, you can just throw something like this on, roll up the blazer, and it's just slightly put together but also very casual at the same time. So I am so excited to actually wear this blazer out at some point, but I think that everybody should have a slightly fun blazer that they don't mind playing around with that really helps dress them up and button up the whole entire outfit. And the last item that I have for today's video is a cardigan. I believe that's what it's called, but a sweater cardigan, a cardigan coat. Maybe that's probably where that came from. This is the J. Crew one. I feel like everybody probably had this when this came out a few years ago. I got it in camel. I also have the longer one in white. And again, I feel like living in Southern California, you don't really get to wear too many coats. And as much as I love all of my coats, it's just not something practical for every day. But for something like this that still has a silhouette of a coat, but it is in sort of the material of a cardigan, it is so much easier to pair. I absolutely love wearing this during the fall and winter time and actually even throughout because in the office you get cold and sometimes it's chilly and you just want to throw something on really easily. This is great because it's not super heavy but it gives you a lot of warmth and the great thing about this is unlike a traditional cardigan it actually has a pretty structured look to it with the two lapels here. So it will just dress up any just casual outfit you have. So I love actually wearing this with a t-shirt um, or with just a long sleeve shirt of some sort layered over this and you'll instantly look so much more put together. So that is it for my five must-have winter outerwear. Let me know in the comment section below, am I missing anything? Are there other must-have essential pieces that you guys have in your closet that I didn't talk about today? Or are there any unspoken uniforms that you guys have at where you guys work or where you guys live? And if you guys agree with my choices, definitely give me a thumbs up and subscribe for more videos like these. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.